Daniel Hillel's orchards near his home in Israel are innovation in action. Each tree row is fed by these plastic tubes that drip water at the base of the tree. Irrigating drop by drop, called drip irrigation, has transformed agriculture by dramatically reducing the amount of water needed. Farmers now rely on it in water-scarce regions from Spanish vineyards to African onion fields to America's fruit and salad bowl, says University of California at Davis hydrologist Jan Haltmans. We in California grow about 50% of the fruits and vegetables of the continental United States. And the reason that is possible is because of indeed these uh, drip and micro-irrigation techniques. Hillel got his start in dryland farming as a pioneer in Israel's Negev desert in the 1950s. The issue was efficient use of water because land is available, it's extensive. Water is limited. These desert farmers did not have the luxury of running irrigation water through channels to their crops, the way farmers have since ancient times. So Hillel and others gave plants just what they needed, just where they needed it. The idea was to apply the water little by little, the way you spoon feed a baby. It worked so well that soon Hillel was traveling the world, showing others how to do it. Experts say drip irrigation is an innovation whose importance is growing as climate change and rising population strain water supplies in many parts of the world. This is where water use, water availability, water use efficiency, and climate change and crop production all converge. And this has been really the essence of my career. A career whose legacy can be measured drop by drop. Steve Barragona, VOA News, Washington.